Okay, in this lesson, I want to explain the pressure tool. That it's very interesting and you can create a pillow uh, from this tool. It's very interesting. First, for explaining what's the pressure and the negative and positive number, I create a simple pattern here. It's here. I click and drag another fabric to there. If you want to rotate around that, just uh, select it in a 3D and right click, you can <clears throat> automatically rotate around that pattern. I use the pin a lot. Go to pin tool, it's here, pin box, pin uh, four side of that pattern to hold it on 3D. If you want, if you select the simulate, as you can see, we have it. We keep the simulation turned on. If you select a pattern, not a fabric. If you select a pattern, if you, sorry. If you go down here, we have a tool that called pressure. It's very easy here. The pressure is zero by default. Uh, as we can see, we have a front of the pattern and the back of the pattern. The front in this direction is a positive number, remember that, and the back is a negative number. If you set the pressure negative number like this, and as you can see, we have a pressure in front direction. If you give a negative number, as you can see, we have a pressure in this direction. It's, it's not wind, it's a pressure, it's infinite power that pull this uh, pattern in one direction. Okay, if we give, uh, turn it down, uh, if we give the pressure zero <coughs> and simulation, I want to control W to unpin them and rotate it. I want to uh, create two, select a default pattern to that. I want to create two uh, different, it's very important for back. And you can rotate it, you can flip it or I simply rotate it. For seeing the back and the front, you can turn off the thickness and as you can see, uh, this is in back of the, our pattern is in front. In a 3D, I swing to each other. Uh, I want to explain how to create an interesting puffy pillow here. Sorry for that. I have to select it. You can go to the selection, hit F to focus around it. Hit F to focus and swing this part with this part. If we have a pressure in a zero in all of them, zero and zero. If you simulate it, it's swing and fall down. Uh, why not fall down? Because in the previous lesson, we changed the simulation gravity to zero, one, nine, eight, double, seven, <coughs> zero, and it's fall down. And as you can see, they are flat. Okay, we turn the simulation on. Uh, this is this pattern. This is a ball pattern. I want to give a, a positive a pressure in this direction. For example, if you set it to one, set it to one or more five, as you can see, it's go up because of the pressure of this pattern goes up. I have to make it zero again to fall down. Okay. <clears throat> okay. For uh, another direction for make a pillow, we give a um, 
turn it off we give for example the five pressure in this direction and exactly the same number in this direction because we have two patterns that swing to each other and they're all in a front if you simulate as you can see we have a puffy pillow making okay we have a <clears throat> this uh, pattern this is in front if you want to pressure in this direction if you set to the one pattern in fly uh, exactly direction of this pressure and the opposite side of this pattern we have another pattern here that it swing exactly in this direction i want to uh, give a force in this direction to <clears throat> Uh, opposite direction of the uh, above pattern so it's exactly positive number five because this is in front five in this direction five in this direction and it goes in its position and do not fly so you can make a interesting pillow with this uh, method okay this is under pressure and in the project, we have more example, an interesting example about the pressure. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.